Hello, my friends. Nice to meet you again. This question comes from Germany Mathematical Olympiad competition of 9th grade. Given a parallelogram ABCD, the midpoint of each side is labeled as E, F, G, and H, respectively. The connecting lines A, G, B, H, C, E, and D, F cut out a quadrilateral W, X, Y, Z inside the parallelogram. The test concludes two parts. First, it is asked to prove that W, X, Y, Z is a parallelogram. And second, it is asked to calculate the ratio of the area of this parallelogram W, X, Y, Z to that of the parallelogram A, B, C, D. Why not give a try, and we will come back soon. The first question is very easy to address. As ABCD is a parallelogram, its opposite sides AD and BC are parallel, and equal to each other. The points E and G are their midpoints, so EA and CG are also parallel, and equal to each other. Therefore, AGCE is a parallelogram as well. We thus get that, AG is parallel to EC. For the same reason, DF is also parallel to HB. As a result, WXYZ is a parallelogram. So we proved it. Before we really discuss the second task, let's first review some properties of a parallelogram's area. We know that the area of a parallelogram is the product of one base and its corresponding height. Therefore, if some parallelograms share the common base and height, their areas are the same. Furthermore, if two parallelograms share the common height, the ratio between their areas is equal to the ratio between their bases. Now, Let's get back to our second task. We know the ratio of CG to CB is 1 to 2. So the ratio of the areas of parallelogram AGCE to ABCD is 1 to 2. We also know the ratio of the area of parallelogram WXYZ to that of AGCE is equal to the ratio of WZ to EC. So all we need to calculate is how big the ratio of WZ to EC is. In the triangle DWC, the side DW is parallel to HZ and the length of DH is equal to HC. Therefore, HC is a mid-segment of this triangle. Therefore, WZ is equal to ZC. For the same reason, we know AX is equal to XY, and XY is equal to WZ. So we have AX is equal to WZ. Now, if we use the mid-segment theorem in the triangle AXD again, we will have EW is equal to half of AX. So EW is equal to half of WZ. Putting them all together, we will have the ratio of WZ to EC is 2 to 5. Therefore, the ratio of the area of parallelogram WXYZ to that of ABCD is 1 to 2 multiplies 2 to 5, so it is equal to 1 to 5. So we make it. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.